Hi guys. Okay, we are in the throat of the tiger. Walmart store in Ithaca, New York here on this gloomy Saturday, October 16th, 2021. So I have been hearing all of this stuff as I know you have about all of these empty store shelves. Uh, people bitching about their toys. They don't have any toys to buy their uh, little bundles of joy. I've heard, of course, toilet paper diapers. And I even heard about coffee and chicken. Alright, so we are heading into the throat of the tiger. Hiding the camera. Two dollars for these. Two bucks for these. For chrysanthemums. We are looking for empty shelves. There's the security guard. I'm sure that I'm doing something illegal. So, uh, where do you think the toys are? Uh, we're waiting for uh, a, an empty shelf. An empty shelf in Walmart. Uh, I see nothing remotely related to an empty shelf. But we are checking particularly toys, toilet paper, diapers, chicken, and coffee. All right. Uh, still waiting for those empty shelves at Walmart. Okay, I know there's some empty shelves around here. Now, bicycles. I, I've been hearing that the bicycle shops are running out of merchandise, that there are no bicycles to be found in this country because of the supply chain crunch. Okay, here's a sign of no bicycles. Yeah, it looks like a real run on bicycles. This is one bike rack at one Walmart. Here's to get your little bundle of joy started off on a bicycle. Alright. Uh, okay, here's the more adult bicycles. Hello. I heard that there was a big rush on bicycles. You could not find a bicycle for Christmas in the US. I see a bunch of bicycles right here at Walmart. That's good to know. Okay. I think we can check bicycles off. You do not need to rush out to buy a bicycle. All right. Sporting goods seems to be overflowing. No sign of. All right. I've yet to find an empty shelf in Walmart. So I guess this is the toys. All right. Hope oh, we do have some empty shelves. All right. We have a rush on. Dino Escape. Okay, our first empty shelf here on October 21st. Little toy dinosaurs you need to get. Alright, we have some more empty shelves. There seems to be a rush on the Auto World. Alright, the Auto World seems to uh, have a supply chain crunch. That man seems to be doing fine. Okay. I don't know, we're down to four dinosaurs. This is getting serious. The, we have a rush on dinosaurs. Hmm. Okay. We seem to be uh, the little cow here. Seems to be safe. Okay. 
anything remotely educational seems to be fine. Okay, we have a rush on the uh, on the speed champions. It seems like. Well, I guess they no longer have toys for little boys and little girls. We have to have gender neutral toys. But the the race cars seem to be uh, getting hit. Now the the gender neutral Barbies. Uh, so if you want to get your little trans boy, no shortage of Barbies here. So the gender neutral Barbies. The fine Nerf guns look fine. Alright, I would say all the dolls for your gender neutral four year old seem to be fine. Alright. The squeaky minis. Yes. Who said that? Who said that? That little alien creature was. All right. So unless you're looking for a race car or a dinosaur for your gender-neutral four-year-old daughter, I don't think there's any. Uh oh, we have a serious hit on the uh, on the kid connection. The kid connection aisle. If you're looking for kid connections for your gender neutral four year old, I would get to Walmart immediately for your kid connection. But other than that, you seem to be fine, but let's really get to the heart. Oh shit, I was supposed to come talk to these folks about a uh, smartphone. I'm going to be buying a smartphone here next week, but I will save that. I need to, shit, I need to get the info that you guys have shared with me. So I will save that adventure. Right now we're going to go looking for toilet paper. Now I have heard about cat food. Now this is actually dog food. This is not good. The, the Beneful dog food. Beneful dog food is getting hit heavy at Walmart. Huh. The Beneful, I don't know guys. We're, we are starting to see some shells. This is the pedigree looking pretty good I wouldn't quite call it an empty shelf right, these are the the large bags of dog food hmm wow what do we got here doggy diapers all right we have a rush on doggy diapers if uh, your dog is in diapers this is no joke. We do have a man, guys. We have a serious rush on uh, doggy diapers. These are uh, diapers built for a male dog. <laughs> Disposable doggy diapers. The world has really come to an end. We have a rush on the... Uh, Pretty weird. The rawhide treats. Good and fun. The good and fun line is in bad shape. Oh, rawhide. That would be coming from uh, 
meat packing houses, wouldn't it? I didn't even see the uh, the cat food. I've heard about cat food. Huh. Well, guys, I don't know. Uh, you know, I started as, as a joke that I didn't think I was going to find any empty. This is the cat food shelf at Walmart on October 21st. I hope you have plenty of mice in your house to feed your cat. Uh, a cat food aisle is the uh, most serious hit I've seen yet. And the doggy diapers. I don't know if they have cat diapers or not. Alright. Should be getting close to the toilet paper. Alright. Now this is uh, paper towels. I haven't heard about paper towels. They seem to be in pretty good shape. The paper towels. Okay, let's go check out I don't know guys, uh, here is the toilet paper aisles. Uh, wow, it really is getting hit. This is the toilet paper aisle on October 21st at one Walmart store. Uh, there is a rush. Now the Scott Toilet Paper Company seems to be in good in good shape. But uh and there you go. Here's the paper towel aisle. I don't know, there's uh we are seeing some empty shelves. Uh, all right, we're heading to the grocery store. No shortage on fresh milk. Not sure what this is supposed to be. Whatever the hell that is is gone. Yeah, there are. Uh, I don't know, guys. Uh, Oh no, I don't see my uh, Dunk, oh there's my Dunkin' Donuts extra extra. Okay, the Dunkin' Donuts creamer seems fine. Bottled water shelves. Huh, there you go. This is in the Finger Lakes of New York. What the hell is this? But guys, I, I don't know. Maybe this is no joke. What this is are these little uh, fruit juices in these pouches. You know, those little kids' fruit juices in those pouches. Uh, plenty of coffee creamer. Well, of course. My biggest fear is the uh, Simply Limeade. What would that be? The Simply Limeade. I see the Simply Lemonade. The beer aisle seems fine. There's some rumor in today's paper about Chicken. Rush on chicken. And, uh, get out there and buy your chicken while you still can. Uh, I don't know. Here's the chicken. This is the, uh, I guess this was the whole chicken. There's every single, you know, whole chicken at this Walmart is gone. Every single one of them is gone. I have hams now. I don't know, guys. Okay, here's the chicken aisle. 
Uh, it's pretty, uh, let's say, a little sparse. The chicken aisle. Beef seems fine. I don't know. Is it time to start panicking? Guys, I'm starting to panic because I have not found my Simply Limeade. I am going into my panic. But anyway, this has been a survey of one Walmart store on the planet in October of 2021. And, uh, I don't know. Uh, let's check out the coffee and finish up with the coffee. That really put the fear of God into me. Okay. The coffee supplies look pretty healthy to me. I was reading that there's going to be a rush on coffee is the next one. Oh, is it? Uh, that, that really, that, that would... Yeah, that one terrified me, the coffee, but it looks like we're safe today. Uh, today. I better grab 50 pounds. Okay, no run on the coffee yet. But, uh, I don't know. Reach your own conclusions. If I had a uh, dog that needed diapers, I would be heading to Walmart right now. Get out there and buy your doggy diapers. Well, you still can. Bye, guys. But, uh, looks like the, the beer aisle looks fine. No sure, no run on the beer run. Daily's Margarita. Frozen bar, I'm sure that's delicious. Alright, guys. I have got to go find the Simply Limeade before I go into a full-scale panic.